Hi and welcome to another tutorial in SOLIDWORKS In this tutorial, let's uh, add another feature to our parts The part is cylinder head Go ahead and um, uh, Before go go to go ahead is I had to I had to modify this feature Select it and go to edit sketch We have 40 here And you have And you have to add And you have to delete this And add from here from the middle of this one you have to put 95 okay uh, delete all of this and add the center line select all of this make it mirror and validate from here Mm, the problem is the fillet we have a problem with the fillet because he can't find this edge um, select it go to edit and you have to delete this one and select this and click ok now you can see the same result you hide this then Mm. Save your file And we have to add Holes here Select this And Add the Circle Another circle here this circle has four use two of them with equals then use center line between this and this one okay the distance between this and this one we have six Okay. Mm. The same thing in this direction. We have six here, six here, then make it horizontal. You can now use this extrude cut with the uh, twenty then use it in the I think we can use it here let's select this I click OK and we have the same result OK save your file and now it's time to add uh, injectors the the injectors the location of injectors select this plan and you have to say 
the your origin is here start by this start by this one okay this is let's make it for construction the distance from here we have 87 then let's uh, add this okay that's the second one and go to this one let's add dimension we have 20 here 15 here and 70 mm, we can't add 70 here because this one we had nearer because this it has to be like this we have to float this one add make a horizontal okay let's float then add the distance we have 70 here now let's go and add um, distance from this construction uh, axis we have 50 from here 15 not not 50 15 and 7 from here let's put 5 here then 3 here You have just to use revolve cut, click OK to close it, and click OK. And we have this result. Then select this. You have to sketch. Select this and start from here here and add relation between these okay then go to feature extrude with extrude cut with five the same thing if we can select this go to linear pattern select this direction switch the direction and click ok we have an error here i don't know what's the problem mm. ok 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 can we add just this Linear pattern, select this. Hmm. I don't know why. Why we can't? Hmm. Then let's add this one. You have just to deselect this or check off this one. Select this cut and click OK. And we have this result. Then let's add the holes. Mm. 
not the holes but here mm, 30 45 and 20 Select this and this one. We have twenty here, then forty forty five from here. No, not forty five, not forty five from the from the middle of this one. Then let's uh, minus ten. Okay. The same thing in this direction. Select all of these, make it mirror. Go to feature, extrude, cut with thirty. Okay, select this pattern with mm -hmm. with seven. Okay, Let's click on okay. Let's put holes here. Mm, sketch, not sketch. Go to feature, hole wizard. Go to position, then here from the middle of this one, we have 45 here and 45 in this direction. In this direction, not the direction, direction. Uh, shoes here, then. Then sixteen nine twelve, okay, that's okay. M twelve here, normal through all here. Then you have to add another here to add another. Is just use center line, select all of this, click here, and select all of this, go to repeat, select this axis, put here 90, and repeat this seven times, and click OK. Click OK again. And we have this result. Okay. It's time to leave you alone. Then I will add another episode next time. Uh, to finish this 
cylinder head I told you we have to, to put three uh, episodes finally we have to put five or six of them to make all of this cylinder head because we have many many features thank you for all subscribers and if you have any question don't hesitate to post it in comment Thank you for watching this tutorial, see you next tutorial.